everyone, this is Daniel Scranton and Kaliandra, and we're going to channel the Arcturian Council. <laughs> oh. Distribute some very exciting energies throughout the galaxy, and of course, we have included all of you there on planet Earth. We are distributing these energies now because we feel the need within so many beings throughout this galaxy for a deeper understanding of who you all really are. We deposit these energies into the fields of each and every being throughout the galaxy with the knowing that your spirit guides will find the perfect time to grant you access to them. 
Now you are probably wondering what these energies will do when your guides decide that the timing is right for you to unpack them. And so we will tell you These energies are about connecting you all to the power that you have within you as source energy beings. To create on a larger scale than you have been able to thus far in all of your physical lifetimes. There have always been restrictions, limitations placed upon you by your very own higher selves. But as you become your higher selves more and more with each passing day, you become ready to create much more in terms of the volume, in terms of how much impact what you create can be on the rest of the galaxy. Those of you who are ready to do this know who you are. You know that you can be trusted with fewer limitations. You know that you are creating with the greatest and highest good of all in mind. You know that you are ready to take humanity further. than you have ever been before there on earth. And you can also feel the power surges moving through you. On a much more regular basis. Therefore, it is time to dream bigger. It is time to imagine more. And most importantly, it is time to expect more. To move through you and to come to you. Because of who you are as source energy beings and because of how much remembering you have done in this single lifetime. You have come so far and we feel your readiness as well as the readiness within other beings throughout this galaxy to create more 
to create on a larger scale and to have that bigger impact that you have always dreamt of having. You are ready if you are receiving this transmission and now is the time. Tap into your own powerful potential by going within and recognizing the vibration of Source. You have always had it within you. And now you are responsible enough to use it and to use it for the good of all beings throughout this galaxy. Well, the Octarian Council, and we have enjoyed connecting with just right here one arm or leg I guess <laughs> dangling front leg dangling off the side of the dining room table and her mother's here too uh, Persephone is her mother's name they uh, they had an unwanted intruder in the house not too long ago so I heard some some rare but uh, coast is clear right now Got a new orchid today, as you can see. It's not the most full <laughs> orchid I've ever purchased, but it was there, it was available. Um, been meaning to get some, some more plants around the house. And today, I or it was today, maybe yesterday, I realized, oh, we've never been to this nursery that's part of a hardware store. Right here in Kula, we live in a, a place called Kula. And it's probably like seven minutes away, eight minutes tops from here. But we've never been there. So today we are we left the beach early because it was way too windy at the beach today. And we're driving and I'm like, hey, let's, let's stop by that nursery because the, the other one we were going to go to on Sunday was closed. So we go there. I see this giant plant. As soon as I walk in, I wanted indoor plants. As soon as I walk inside, there's a giant plant. And I was like, how much is that to the guy? And at first he jokes with me, he goes, $300. <laughs> but then he looked it up, it's like $62. I was like, oh yeah, definitely. Because I wanted a new plant for my office. And so um, we got that one and these orchids with the new uh, fancy, uh, whatchamacallit, pots and, uh, and a hanging plant. And my wife just trusted me. She's like, just go in, I'll stay in the car with Talea. And I came back and the the big plant barely fit in the car, <laughs> you know, like you had to put the back seat down, and get it in there. So, um, yeah, that was today. We, uh, I got all the recycling done, which was an insane amount of work. Um, cause we just let it pile up and pile up. So I got some help on, on that from our coconut guy. So all the recycling was done today, which was great. And then hike, beach, plant and flower shopping, and then home. And I spent quite a bit of time with Talea once we got home because my wife wanted to do her nails. <laughs> she doesn't want Talea around for that. So, uh, so Talea and I hung out a lot. Um, Talea has a birthday coming up, by the way, our baby. And if you're interested in uh, getting her a first birthday gift. There's a gift registry down in the comments below. I also have uh, intuitive sound healing, oh, sound hands-on and light language healing academy. Down a link to that course, which starts on the 29th down below. Um, <clears throat> Kalyandra's just, just like 
so missing having me in my office all day where she can come in and get this kind of attention. Um, I started watching a new show that Warrior Nuns, the, the, if you're going to watch it, <laughs> just know that the ending to season one will be unsatisfying. Um, it's going to definitely have a season two, I guess, because otherwise they, they could not have ended season one that way. Um, but like I said before, it's a decent show. Um, I started watching another just okay show last night called Motherland. It's Fort Salem about witches who are like the, the U.S.'s, uh, now they're like in their, their army or whatever, the Marines. I don't, I'm not exactly sure what branch of the, <laughs> of the military that the witches are in, but it's like, oh, the cool part is the witches use, um, sound to, you know, defend themselves and as uh, an offensive thing too. So, um, so they're, they're making tones and stuff, which is cool. Um, tomorrow's the last day of my staycation. Uh, it's been absolutely wonderful and, uh, gotten to spend so much time with my wife and my daughter and, uh, yeah, really appreciate living here on Maui. <clears throat> and, uh, yeah, it's, it's amazing how, how much we really do just need to recharge our battery sometimes. Um, cause when I'm, when I'm working a normal work week is, is pretty hectic having a, a baby and doing all this. Um, anyway, uh, that's enough about me. I am, oh, I also have a Patreon page. Uh, there's a link down there to Patreon. If you're watching this on YouTube, all these links are really available on YouTube, but wherever else you might be watching it, um, maybe not. So I have new video content on the Patreon that you only get when you sign up to be a member, a patron. Um, and I'll have more coming. I, I have some ideas. I watched somebody's video the other day on Law of Attraction, and I thought, wow, this guy is so off. At least his perspective is so much different than mine that it made me want to make a Law of Attraction video, which I will at some point. All right, I'm off to the couch now. Blessings. Namaste. Love you guys. Uh, see you tomorrow night. Subscribe if you haven't already, wherever that is on your screen. Because I do this every single night, even on my vacation. I'm still making videos. Just wanted to point that out. <laughs> Bye, everybody.